Hey what's up guys, Chicks here from Chicks Tech Reviews. Today I'm going to answer a question I get a lot. Is the 2017 Nvidia Shield TV the best Android TV box currently available? So this is the 2017 Android Shield TV. So first of all, let's go through the specs. So this has the NVIDIA Tegra X1 processor, which consists of a quad-core Cortex-A57 and a quad-core Cortex-A53, giving you a processing power of 8 cores. Okay, the GPU is an NVIDIA Maxwell 256-core GPU. So you've got a very powerful CPU and graphics chip in this TV box. Okay, you've got 3 gigabytes of the RAM, 16 gigabytes of internal storage, dual band Wi-Fi, 2.5 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz BGN and AC. You got Bluetooth version 4.1. You got the latest Android version 7 Nogart. This supports Ultra HD 4K HDR playback at 60 frames per second. Supports Dolby Atmos, True HD 7.1, 5.1, DTS, DTS X. So let's have a quick look what you get in the box. So you get the Shield controller. So having a quick look at the controller, the controller is quite amazing. It has a built-in mic for voice search, hands-free voice support. You have a 3.5mm jack for headphones, dual vibrations, an IR blaster for TV volume and power control, and an amazing 60 hour plus battery life. Okay, um, looking at the Shield remote control, so this looks like a quite a basic remote control, but you also got a built-in mic for voice search and also has an IR blaster, so you can control your TV's volume and power. You get the Shield remote, you get a USB cable, a HDMI cable, and a UK power adapter. And last but not least, the actual NVIDIA Shield box. This box looks amazing. The TV box is so slim, it is only 2.5 millimeters in thickness and weighs only 250 grams. The ports on the back, you have two USB 3 ports, a HDMI, a LAN port, and a power socket. So this is the home screen for the NVIDIA Shield TV. It's running Android TV OS. Let me give you a quick demo. So at the top, you can search by voice or search by typing. So this top bar over here shows you everything that's trending and makes suggestions based on your watch history and activities. So just below that is where you'll find your apps. So all the apps you install you will find here. Um, so this already comes pre-installed with Amazon Prime, Netflix and YouTube. You can play movies and TV shows in real 4K. So let's have a quick look at the Google Play Store. So it's really easy to download an app on here. So let's, for example, download Sling TV. So you just hit install. It'll ask you to accept and it will immediately start downloading. Um, I love the interface of Google Play Store on the Android TV OS. Um, it's absolutely brilliant to navigate. It feels really good um, and it's really easy to use. So now this app you will find on the home screen. So if I just press the home button, um, scroll down, and if you go right towards the end of the apps, you will see Sling TV there. So really, really nice interface and really easy to use. So looking at the game section under Google Play, you have tons of free and paid games to choose from. The layout is great, very fast to navigate around and downloading and installing games is very quick and easy. So you also have a separate NVIDIA game section below. When you open it, you'll have lots of options here. First option you have is my library and it will show you all the games you currently own. Um, you also have the option to set up game stream, which lets you stream your favorite PC games from your PC to your NVIDIA Shield TV. So I streamed a few games out from my PC to test out how good it would work. I'm streaming at 1080p 60 frames per second and the games I played were console quality. Um, amazing. Geoforce Now is their game streaming service. You also have the options to buy some of these games and the ones that say free for members is the games you can play for free once you sign up to their $7.99 per month game streaming service. So all the rest of the games are categorized on the left hand side. So you have showcase, staff favorites. Um, you've got so many different type of games here. Um, you've actually got exclusives. So Resident Evil 5, it was remastered and designed for the Nvidia Shield TV. So you've got quite a large category of games here and the games play absolutely amazing on this console. This is an amazing gaming console. So the Tegra X1 chip that's in the Shield is actually made for gaming. Um, you can see if you compare it to an Xbox 360, the, the Shield actually has a much better spec and is much more powerful. 
So this box also comes complete with Google Cast built in. So you can cast and mirror your tablet and phones directly to the Android TV box and it works great. So I love how easy it is to uninstall apps. You hold down the select button over the app you want to uninstall and then you press down and you hit uninstall and the app is gone. Okay, and if you want to move the apps around, you just hold the select button down and press left or right and you can move that app around. So customizing the apps and moving stuff around is really, really good. So the 2017 Nvidia Shield TV has achieved a total benchmark score of 132,483. So looking at the results, the Nvidia Shield TV has shot straight to number one with an amazing score of 132,483. I was expecting a very high score. I didn't know it would be this high. So there you have it guys. Nvidia Shield TV is the best Android TV box available. So that was the 2017 Nvidia Shield TV. Um, this console is an absolute beast. It's the most powerful Android TV box ever made so far. And I think only Nvidia can beat Nvidia. So I would not count on another TV box to match the Nvidia anytime soon. You can pick this up for £189.99 for the 16 GB model. What I'll do is I'll put the links in the description so you guys can check this item out. And if you like it, you can of course go ahead and purchase one for yourselves. So that's all for this video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, hit the notifications button, and as soon as I make a video live, you'll be alerted first. I hope you guys found this video useful. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you all have a brilliant day.